The disappearance is a perfect example of what I call visual mentalism. A packet of nine cards is removed from an envelope. The cards are all different and given a fair shuffle. The spectator calls stop at any time and without any suspicious moves or sleight of hand whatsoever, the spectator takes a peek at the card they stopped at. All of the cards are then immediately given to the spectator to hold for safekeeping. From inside the envelope, the performer removes a single clear sheet of plastic and the spectator verifies that the card they are thinking of is one of nine cards printed on the sheet. The spectator is then given the clear sheet to hold along with the nine cards. Asking the spectator to concentrate on their card, the performer slowly waves a lighter beneath their hands. The performer only says three words, going, going, gone. And just like that, the impossible happens. When the audience examines the clear plastic sheet, they find that the one card they were thinking of has completely disappeared. And when the cards are dealt out, instead of nine, there are only eight. And the card the spectator was merely thinking of is found to have also disappeared. The disappearance relies on a very fresh principle that allows you to immediately repeat the effect with a different card, but still using the same clear plastic sheet. The disappearance is clearly impossible.